Seems like a circus sideshow is now considered therapy. A local palm reader is now spending her time in small cafes and local parks advising others on different life choices. We now that I have a clearer view, like you are, you are your love line is actually really nice. You're I said earlier that you were complicated and I didn't mean it in that you're like a crazy complicated person. I don't think you are, but um, but you just feel things really deeply. I've been doing pop readings about, um, I would think eight years, I guess, eight or 10 years, something like that. Although I've been learning for longer, pretty much my whole life. So maybe 20 years or more. Um, I mean, my mom was uh, the first ordained minister in Texas and she was pretty into crystals and spirits and all that cool stuff. So I was sort of intrigued that she was really into it. Um, and then um, my dad, was really um, supportive in that realm also. Um, so he got me my first tarot cards when I was 12 or 13. Your family chain is a little, um, you can see it's a little cut off here, so it looks like you're really close with them and you're really involved, but there's a little, there's either, there's either a period in your life where there's a separation or feeling very disconnected, and then there's a reconnect. My whole goal when I do readings is to make people feel good, so it's not like I avoid bad things, I actually do go there and I try to make things Better. So when I have people coming to me who get upset or maybe they'll, they might have a release and they might actually cry but it's, it's usually like a release, like they're letting go of something rather than just crying because they're scared. You do want to be loved though. Like, um, so, um, you know, uh, are you an only child? I'm the baby. You're the baby, okay. I just feel like, um, just see you like wanting, like, me too, like, I want to be loved, like, um, like you're like a little, little bit alone and you just, you, you know. <laughs> wanted to be included, okay? <laughs> so I just saw you as like um, an only child or something, just sitting alone like, I want to play. So I'm schooled in psychology and healing and I've done a lot of healing modalities and trainings and certificates. And I just I just want for myself it, what I want for other people, which is just to feel better and good. <laughs> Alicia says that a lot of people have misconceptions about palm reading. She says that it does not predict the future or tell you how successful or rich you might be, but it does advise you to make smarter life choices. She doesn't work out of a tent, but she will do house calls, events, and graduations. This is Felicia Bearden, Boston Chatter.